All right, y'all. Here we go. Today, we're going to talk a little bit about defensive coordinator Charles Kelly. All right. How'd I do? You did all right, bro. All right, y'all. What's up? What's good? What's going on? Welcome to Buffed Up TV. Today, man, we're going to really talk about Charles Kelly and his philosophy with the defense for the Colorado Buffaloes, man. This man has some amazing things to say. Um, this is why I'm convinced that the culture of this program will prevail. And like I said, all the Buff fans out there that are... Um, that have went through the past of uh, disappointing losing seasons. Listen, we can look up now, man, because it's a new culture in town and the philosophy is to win now. So without further ado, man, let's go in and listen to what Charles Kelly, the defensive coordinator out of Alabama, had to say. say uh, I'm excited to be here. I'm excited to have the opportunity to work for Coach Prime. And I can tell you right now, I came here because of one thing, his standard. And we will win now. That's what we're here to do. Just to tell you a little bit about myself, this will be my 33rd year coaching. I just finished up four years at the University of Alabama. Prior to that, I was at the University of Tennessee, and I spent five years as a defensive coordinator at Florida State. But I'm used to winning, but I'm used to being around people that have high standards. That's why I'm working here. I'm excited to work with everybody on this team. I'm excited to be a part of this program, and I'm excited to see the work that you put into it. Just remember this, okay? Success only comes before work in a dictionary. It's time to go to work. You know, and it's competing in every drill, it's, and it's competing against yourself to, to do the th right things over and over and over. Because once you do that, then that becomes a habit. And habits are, you know, that's who you are. You know, you said it exactly right. I mean, there's no substitute for experience. That's how you learn to play the game, is to play. And uh, that's how you learn to process the game. So I think uh, that being, that doesn't guarantee you success in the future. What it does, it gives you, you know, gives you that experience and what you do with that experience that makes you better and uh i've you know i've seen that i've seen some a lot. all right first thing it's good to have everybody in here as a group okay so what we are wanting to do starting today all right you guys have been in the weight room you've been on the field running you've already started creating habits what we want to do is continue creating the right habits every little thing counts Every little thing is important. So where do we start right here? So I want you to follow along up here and we're going to talk about our philosophy of our defense. And I said this the first meeting, okay? This is our defense. This is not where I came from, Alabama's defense. This is the University of Colorado's defense. The trademark of the Colorado defense is aggressive and physical play. We will be physically strong at the line of scrimmage and we will hustle and we will pursue relentlessly. We will be hard and sure tacklers. We will be successful on defense if we give 100% physical effort, play with physical toughness and do not make mental mistakes. What I just read, you control every bit of that. So once again, guys, you see, you see what the culture is. You see where this program is going. And when I look at it, man, let me tell you something. Even if this program, when we look at it, we've got some five stars. We got some four stars. We got, a, we got the majority of three stars. And some of these guys are probably uh, JUCO transfers, transfers from other schools. Um, they're going to have another uh transfer period coming up in may so like i said 
when I look at this talent on this team, man, these guys really, really want it and they bought into it. So I believe a lot of these players that weren't as looked at as a lot of these other four and five star players, man, they're going to show up and show out, man, because they have something to prove. So um, thanks for tuning in. I appreciate you subscribing to the channel all the people you know who you are man i appreciate you and love you all uh thanks for all supporting the channel peace and blessings to all and with that i'm out Guess what?